a lot of slaps being given today, but bro, do you know how soft you have to be to wait till your opposing fighter gets up and goes to the bathroom so you can hit his translator for translating your opposing fighter's words? And disclaimer to everyone if you're not familiar, Jay Park is Korean, so obviously he's going to be on the Korean fighter side. Like, it's not really that mind-boggling. I'm going to read this tweet because it pretty much sums it up pretty pretty perfectly actually um korean music artist jay park who served as the korean zombies translator during his recent appearance on the show was slapped by brian ortega during tonight's event park tells me a scuffle ensued and then broken up ortega took issue with park's translation at the show and uh, i know there's some back history behind this apparently jay park said he was ducking him um he was ducking like the korean zombie that's why this this whole thing ensued and then um ortega tweeted that hey i'm gonna slap the jay park kid but bro don't do it while your fighter is like oh while the person you're fighting is away at the bathroom like yeah you're an mma fighter you know how to fight like no one's taking that away from you you could probably beat the average person up like that's that's clear but bro don't do it once your fighter goes to the bathroom and one more other thing i just want to get off my chest i seen a lot of like i have nothing against the bts fandom i actually think bts is a very talented group um i know there's some like bad bad blood between like jay park fans and uh bts fans because jake park was talking about like the korean scene being popularized in the u.s and then he mentioned himself and bts and people were like oh how dare you compare yourself to bts but that's really not what he was saying um a lot of people are retweeting like oh yes jay park got slapped and it's so funny because like we're in bts on like an anti-violence campaign and you're over here promoting violence so it's kind of like very very hypocritical in my opinion um, but yeah, all I really have, I just think this is a soft move, like, you're an MMA fighter, you know how to fight, if you're gonna do something, do it while your fighter, like, your opposing fighter is there, don't check it out and wait till he goes to the bathroom so you feel like you need to attack the translator. Um, very soft move, in my opinion, um, let me know your thoughts in the comments below, and peace out.